All right, all right, all right. We've got a new arrival here. This is a 2024 Tidewater 2300 Carolina Bay. And this beautiful boat sports a 23 foot, eight inch length. She's got an eight foot, nine inch beam. Carries 69 gallons of fuel. She's got a beautiful big old Carolina flare on her to keep you dry. Nice chines and lines. She's a single stepped hull. That's gonna help with your performance and fuel efficiency. The color is vapor blue. So she's vapor blue top and bottom. Got some nice electric trab trim tabs. Yamaha 250 VMAX. That's that SHO VMAX motor. Big old three blade stainless steel Yamaha Saltwater Series 2 prop. There's what prop she's running. Got some C blaze underwater lights nice swim platform with a dive ladder she's got a single power pole uh, I can add another if you want but you see single power pole she got a nice live well back here on both the port and starboard side one here one there she's got another live well up towards the bow as well Rod holders are plenty, cup holders. This seat here pops up. Got a nice little seat in the back. And then this thing pops up here. This insert comes out. And then you've got your bilge access. Very, very convenient. This one's got the nice leaning post. Folding bolsters and armrests. Everything's powder coated black. She's gonna have a nice cooler right here. We've got some tackle storage underneath here as well. That way you can store some of your gear. Speakers everywhere. Raw water wash down here. Nice rod storage. Your console is vapor blue as well to match the boat. And the top of your T-top is vapor blue. Beautiful black powder coating, matches that Yamaha SHO real nice. Rod holders everywhere. Wireless phone charger. She's got the jack plate. Trim tab switches, 12 inch Garmin with a nice Lexan black dash. That way it just all kind of goes together. Nice push button switch panel. Yamaha CY5. She's got the JL Audio Media Master 50. It's for your spreader lights. She's got convenience lights. Nice dry storage up there. Old Richie Compass. 2300 Carolina Bay. This one's got a little porta potty in it. You can see your house batteries will go here. Your trolling motor batteries will go there. And she's got a battery charger for the trolling motor and a two bank, three bank for the trolling motor, two bank for your house and engine. This guy right here will fold down and secure along here. That way to put a nice cover there between your wiring and, and the elements or whoever's using that beautiful porta potty. You see, she's got the Sea Star Power Assist steering. It's got some cushions as well. The cushions are in my service department, but it's got the full bow cushion package and it'll have some backrests that go right here as well. And then you've got nice uh, rod storage in here. Nice rod locker or dry storage. You know, Tidewaters do a double foam filling as well. They fill it when it's in the mold and then they pop it out of the mold uh, and then hit all the spaces, make sure everything's good. So they hit it twice. Another live well up here. Got a little five gallon bucket down here for your cast net. A little USB port with a type C to do some charging. And you see in these rod lockers, they're lockable, which is good, but they've got PVC pipes at the end of the rod lockers. That way it'll, cause that's all foam up in there. So that way it'll keep your rods protected. Big casting, big bow casting area. You 
We've got a big fish box here. This thing's got a Minn Kota Instinct Riptide, so it's the self-deploy. Looks like it's a uh, 36 volt. Got your anchor locker here. Trolling motor plug. Already wired in already. This thing is ready to go. She's a beautiful vapor blue. Remember, she's 23 feet, 8 inches long with an 8 foot, 9 inch beam. 69 gallons of fuel. This one's going to have the, uh, the bow shade on it as well. So you see in that black bag right under is a couple big uh, poles, which will go in those rod holders here. And then at the end of the pole, your shade will attach to the end of the pole and then attach to these hooks right here. And while we're up here, you can see she's got the Kingfish rod holders as well on both sides. Boy, this thing is the bee's knees. So you know the deal, Jared sells boats. Look at that jack plate, nice Atlas jack plate. Woo! Boy, this is a pretty boat. I've got financing, I've got insurance. I take trades. I got a beautiful white dog roaming around here somewhere. She got hot and went inside, but we got Molly here. That way you can say hi when you want. Check out that step on the hole there. That's clean. That's clean. So you got it, 2300 Carolina Bay from Tidewater. Let's get her done. Send me some money. We'll make it yours.